Hello YouTube, uh, I'm back, and uh, I haven't done this in a long time, so I decided to make an updated top 10 cards list. Um, so top 10 cards in my collection, it's actually 11, uh, there were two that I couldn't decide whether to put as 10th, so I just included them both. Um, so yeah, I just haven't done this in like a year, I think, so I just thought I'd do it right now. So tied for 10th would be this card, Bart Star for the Retro Auto cool looking card. And my Stefan Taylor uh, 2013 Limited 1 of 1 RPA. I still have faith. Uh, he is second string behind Andre Ellington this year. That is better than he was third string last year. And I don't have faith in Andre Ellington's ability to stay healthy just because he is a very small running back in the same division as the Niners, the Rams, and the Seahawks defenses which are known for being hard-hitting, punishing defenses. So I just don't have a lot of faith he'll stay healthy. And I'm also a little messed up, but I'm hoping he doesn't stay healthy, just so fun until I get the chance to start. He did start one game last year where she did all right. I think he averaged like three and a half yards per carry, something like that. Um, also, so those are the two cards tied for 10th. Uh, ninth, I have stolen another case of this card. I'm working on that. But I'm probably not going to get rid of it anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Um, Five-star booklet, auto, dual auto. Uh, Weaver and C.J. Wilson, numbers of 10. So cool card right there. Number eight, this is for trade, if anyone's interested. It's a uh, two-color and one, four-color and another. Dual auto, dual patch booklet, or a 15. Of Mike Glennon and Matt Barkley from Supreme. So that's for trade, if anyone's interested. Number seven, get this out of its thing. This is going to go up a lot when he becomes a Hall of Famer, which will be, I think, in the next year or so. Um, 2014 Museum uh, booklet auto. Bat, three jersey pinstripes auto of uh, Pud Rodriguez. That's available if anyone's interested. Sevens number six is my Max Freed Clayton Kershaw Bowman Draft Picks Dual Auto. Number out of twenty-five. Um, probably isn't going to go anywhere. Huge fan of Freed with the same high school as him. And uh, Kershaw is um, he's Kershaw, so it's probably staying with me. Number five. Um, don't think this is going to go anywhere. I haven't redeemed it yet. I'm um, still holding on, probably going to redeem it soon. It's my bow and black auto of uh, Julio Arias. I believe he's 17 right now. I think he turns 18 in August. I'll check right now. But yeah, I'm pretty sure he's still 17. Yeah, turns 18 in August. Um, number four is. Nolan Ryan, three color patch auto out of Immaculate Basketball. Uh, so one of the non basketball autos in the set. Number 25, on card auto. Really nice. Um, beautiful auto. I've watered one of those autos, this is about as nice as it could get, so I chose this one. Um, Pedro Martinez, Museum, auto out of five. Yeah. That's number three. So, looking to move this card actually right now. I'm moving to get rid of it. I think I'm just hit me up. And these two probably aren't going to go anywhere. This one definitely isn't. This is my uh, 2012 five star football. My Brett Fireball card auto. I'm never getting rid of this, ever. It was a gift. So, staying with me. I'm about 85. Number one is my 2013 National Treasures printing plate autograph of Richard Sherman. Uh, sweet card, so probably gonna keep this also, but you can offer on it. Um, Madden cover athlete. So yeah, it's my top ten cards. If you guys are interested? You can check it out. So. Um, only one that I really don't want to move whatsoever are the Urias, the Favre, and the Freed and Kershaw uh, dual auto, and the Weaver Wilson booklet. Everything else I guess you can offer on. Oh, and the Stephon Taylor is not going to go anywhere either. 
I doubt anyone's going to want that, but no one really collects stuff on the other besides me and Cardinals fans. Um, so that's it. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.